So Square is another great processor, and I'm going to show you how to use the API keys. The first thing you need to do is go to developer.squareup.com. Just go to developer.squareup.com, and you want to log in. You have to get, of, of course, your Square account first set up. And, but once you do, go to developer.squareup.com and click developer dashboard here. And then it's going to take you somewhere in here where it's going to say applications. And you're going to go ahead and make a new one. So you're going to get make a new Square API key. So you're just going to click on this right here. And we'll just call this uh, my classes, I guess. You could call it anything you want. And press save. And there you it there it is right there. You just click on this, and this is how you are gonna copy and paste these sandbox ID, the token ID, which you could show right here, and so on. And you could switch it from sandbox to production. Production is basically you want to go live and you want to have people give you live cards. Sandbox is you're just gonna test this out and see if it works. Um, I like to just straight up just go to production and just use it on my on production um, just because I like to test with like a $1 payment anyways when I'm checking out so I don't really need to go to the sandbox so let's go ahead and just copy the production uh, application ID and you're gonna go and you're gonna go back here to the square here and you're gonna say okay that's the application ID you're gonna paste that one in there and then you're going to say the production access token right there so that's a really big one there so I'm just going to copy that and go back here to personal access token and then it's going to ask for location ID as well so and that would be over here in locations click locations and then you could get your location ID right here it's just this right here you're copying over and you're just replacing it just like that. And that's it. Just make sure to change it to the live if you're using the production one. And if you're using the sandbox, use sandbox. Since this is live, I'm gonna go ahead and make it live right there. And I'm gonna press save just like that. And that's it. I highly recommend you test it though with like a dollar payment, meaning you open up a new browser, you go to like a class you already set up, add a price to it you could just put a dollar or something like that and just check out with a different email address and check out with the square and um, just you know make sure it, it runs right then you could go back into just squareup.com and you could check all your funds so if you just go to squareup.com and you log in you could uh, check you know who paid you and all this other stuff within your dashboard here